Okay, hey guys, so I'm with another video, back with another video, I mean. Um, I know it's been a while, like 11 months since I posted my last few videos on this, but um, I'm going through a little bit more horses that I have, that I have fully trained, and I think I added one that I don't think I've shown in my last two episodes of this. So, I am now, and, uh, yep, so, my last horse that I trained was right here, or is, um, otherwise known as Water Butterfly. She is the at horse, the Texas Bluebell, North Scottish horse, at horse. Uh, she was originally level 10 when I transferred her, but I worked on her five more levels, level 15, she's maxed out now. So, um, yeah. Also, the nurse Swedish horse that I don't have yet, um, I will go and show it real quick, but then I'll have to come back and do this. Because I kind of want to make this video a little bit longer than the last two. Or longer than the last one. The first one was pretty much, I think, 20 something minutes long. So that one was long, but the second one wasn't as long. So I'm going to try and make this one an even. Uh, I can't talk. I never can. I'm going to make this one even longer by maybe a few minutes or something. But yeah, here's. Water butterfly. And, uh, yeah, yeah, you don't need to tell me. <laughs> Cat's coming in. Yep, so. I do have some of the. I think I have a few of the druid clothes. Maybe even one thing attacked, but I don't know. I've got a few. So, I'm still working on the other <laughs> free horse, but you have to work it, you have to get it worth your time. So, yeah, hold on, let me just I'll close my door. Okay, that's better. <laughs> I had to close my door. Alright, so, I'm gonna go show you guys the other free horse that I'm working on getting. The birthday one was free. But now there's another one that I'm trying to get. It's going to take me more than a couple months to get it. So. Okay. You guys can probably already see her. It's this girl. It's going to take me a long time to get her. But it is the Room Runner. She's also another Swedish horse, North Swedish horse, because you can tell by the model. Um, yeah, this is the one I'm currently working on, trying to get, and if I do end up getting her, then um, that'll be great, because <laughs> it kind of reminds me of the the um, the other horses with their own little built-in kind of horse crest with them, like north and east. I don't have east yet, but I have north. As you guys will know. Yes, I'm talking about horse rain tails. Um, yep, this one just kind of resembles those two horses in a way because of that. Um, but they don't have this, which is cute. Um, I'm not gonna lie, the Room Runner North Spears horse is one of my dreams to have. Also, if you guys don't notice it, uh, I'll just say it right now. The mouth, when they're eating, like when they're grazing, is like kind of broken. Which, I don't quite know why, but it is. Just look closely at the mouth. You'll see the jaw kind of stay open while they graze, which is 
I'm thinking it's like a bug or something, but I don't know. Their jaws are broken. So, I just wanted to say that in case none of you guys noticed that, because I actually noticed it when... Yeah, look. Yeah, see? The jawline's like broken. I mean, I still love the most gold horses, but they're a bit bugged. A bit flawed. But they're still cute. Just broken jaw. <laughs> I'm not trying to make you guys, like, want to get rid of your North Swedish horses or even the Brinicle, because the Brinicle's probably broken too, but... You could still keep them, just keep in mind that the jaws are broken. It doesn't bug me that much, but... Um, yeah, it'll probably bug some people once they start to notice that. That, um, that's a bug. It doesn't bug me, though. Yeah, just watch their jawline, that's all I can say. The Green Runner will be mine soon. So, let's get back to going through my other maxed horses. Alright, so here we are back in my home stable, and with that being cleared out of the way, I'm going to go through the other maxed horses I've got so far. They greet you, they greet you sometimes, so it's really cute. Alright, so this is Mystic Stone. Um, you guys probably know her. Well, you guys probably only know her by the voting poll. So, and let me get my character from her. Okay, there we go. Uh, yeah, she has not been cared for because after I get them maxed out and fully trained, I don't work on their daily care anymore as much as I probably should. I don't do it, but I keep them because why would I sell them? Um, I just earned the shillings by doing races and stuff like that instead of selling horses. I kind of think that's pointless. I used to do that, but I stopped because I figured I'd probably need them at some point, so. Yeah, this is one of the magic horses. Um, so how do I... I think you have to use them to change their, their look, but, yeah. Yeah, when I used her, I never did put tack on her, as you guys can clearly tell. Okay, so there's her. Alright, next we have Sienna Star. My first... My, sil my first cell friend say, apparently that's how you say it. I didn't know how to say it until I'd be watching other um, players and YouTubers say the name. It's cell friend say, so I get it now. She's not taken care of either because she's maxed out. <laughs> Pretty much the day I bought her. I started training her like immediately because she's cute. I love the idol animations. So. Yep, so that's her. And then we have. Next we have the heat run. This is what I was talking about. So this is its normal look. This is Bee Catcher. My heat run. So like this, she looks normal, but after you put her in her magnetic form, she has horns, like ram horns. Um, let me just kind of use her real quick to show what I mean. There we go. Okay, so there 
just the horns I was talking about. She is a hedron. Since I was just current, just on her a minute ago, I can't check. But I know that the horse is a mare, an adult. She's also one of the Christmas horses. Okay, so next we've got. Gosh, I love night dust. This is night dust. So, if you guys have done the night dust quests with. It was a quest that evolve around Madison and. Um. Night Dust, pretty much the two main characters are Night Madison and Night Dust. Um, I got this horse because it looks directly, it looks directly, it looks exactly like Night Dust. He was a Welsh pony, and is, but he had a serum injected into him, so he looks really different. I'll actually show that in a minute too, because again, I want to make this longer than the last episode. That's what I aim for doing anyway. And if you can tell, the saddle pad is his saddle pad. Mm, I can't. It's Night Dust saddle pad. So. Yep. Let me get on him and go to the other Night Dust. <laughs> I already completed the quest for the Night Dust, and after I completed it and got the got Night Dust saddle pad, that's when I started training him because I couldn't hold back. So. Let's go to Madison and Night Dust. We're taking the bridge that connects from New Hillcrest to South Hoof. And I'll just make a beeline straight for over there. Over, over where Madison and Night Dust are. Okay, we're almost there. I just passed the wild horses, meaning Night Dust's kind. The Welsh ponies. Alright, here we are. Okay, so, yep, this is Night Dust's actual form. That's Night Dust to real look. Not gonna lie, the Night Dust quest was a little bit tricky, but I was able to do it. Yep, so, Night Dust. <laughs> look at that. You can't tell me that doesn't look good on Night Dust. He is so cute. Alright. I'm looking at a blanket. That's not just blanket. Alright, so... Let's go back and go through the other horses that I have out, many of the ones that are matched. I think one of them that I have in the stalls, I don't know if I, I don't remember if I used it in my other two episodes, but I guess I'll find out when I go back and look at the footage. Taking the bridge again. Okie dokie. So, we're back again. Put night dust right next to water butterfly. Okay, so now we have. All right, so now we have paper machine. Um, yeah, she's or he's unhappy, but um, well, actually, I don't know if a gelding is for a mare or a stallion, so it's. 
undecided, I guess. But, yeah, this one was a horse that was doing, what was it called? It was a H&M all-in collaboration with Star Stable Online, so I got this horse. I can bring out the pet, but... Eh. Yep, so here's Paper Machine, otherwise known as H&M All-In. I kind of wanted to give them the H&M All-In, but they don't have that for an option, so I can't do that. <laughs> also, care has not been done, because I haven't been using this horse since I maxed it out. Okay, so that's our next maxed out horse. Next, we have um, Arctic Roll, which is my unicorn. Um, so it is the Pasofino mold, mold, model. You have to text me at the wrong time every time. Sorry, guys. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is the Pasofino model, and it's a unicorn. They have two other ones in. Valdale, but I can't afford either one of them, so I'm probably not gonna buy them. They're cute though, but I mean, I'm good with just one. So, yeah, hold on. Man, it's gonna be fun to blur out the name to keep them anonymous. But, yep, anyways, moving on. So, this is my other Max horse. You guys can clearly tell, tell by the golden nameplate. And then we have. Did I use Dragon Angel? Did I have her in one of my other episodes? I don't think I did. But yeah, she is a Yorvik Warmblood. Like my starter horse. My starter horse is also a Yorvik Warmblood. But, um... I bought this one specifically because of the dapples on this horse. Because I really like the dapple horses. So, I bought her. I don't know how long I've had her, but I think I think I used her before I bought Sienna and trained Sienna. So, yep, she's maxed out. Next, we have this Frisian. I don't remember using her in one of my other two episodes, so I added her for this part. So this is Aurora Twilight. She is a Yorvik Frasian. And as cute as these horses are, they are also kind of bugged with their animations, but I still love them. Um, also, no care done, because I haven't used her since I maxed her out. So, yeah. Okay, so... Again, I'm gonna have to blur out the name to keep them anonymous. So, with that, that should be all the horses that I have concluded for this video, this episode. And I will see you guys in the next episode. This might actually be my favorite episode of going through my max horses because of Night Dust. So, yeah. yeah, again, if you guys have done the Night Dust quests, you guys know what I'm talking about. Alright, so, wait, do I need a thumbnail? I think I do. It's okay, I'll grab it after I finish this, because I'm too lazy to do it at the moment. Okay, so... I'll see you guys in the next one. I think the video's been long enough. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this. And, yeah. Love you, butterflies. Bye.